Bail Daily's Off the Hill. I'm Trisha Swenson. Joining me now, we have Jeremy Beck. He's the president of Futurian Systems, and you are electronic systems integrators here in the Vail Valley. Tell us about this. Pretty amazing. Yes. So we started the company 13 years ago in North Texas and then launched up here in Colorado seven years ago. And we are what's called an electronic systems integrator. So we deal with audio, video, voice data security, and we specialize in home automation. Well, we're in one of the beautiful homes that you've worked on in the Ville Valley. Yes, Tell us about are. some of the features. So this home has some really cool features, everything from your audio video distribution to lighting control, to climate, to Wi-Fi, to camera surveillance. You name it, this home has it. And all of it is right here. We can just dial it in from the screens. You've got the remote. That's correct. So what we have is typically we have these remotes that clutter the table. And uh, these remotes control all the different aspects of the technology, the TV. We consolidate everything into one single remote. And this allows you to press a single button here in the center and then we'll bring the display down and put a on-screen interface up here that allows you to control not only your audio video but every aspect of the home. That's so nice to have it all in one place. It gets a little confusing with the more remotes there are. Indeed. So not only do we have audio video control but we have security, we have comfort, we have lighting. For example in security not only do you have the security system that you can bring up but also cameras. For example all of these cameras are on Beaver Creek, Vail Village, and on site. So you could be able to go into these cameras and view a live stream, this is Eagle Airport for example, of what's going on at the airport right on your wow. TV screen. Not only that, but uh, climate control is a big part of these systems. This gives you a consolidated menu of all of your thermostats. So in a home like this, when you're dealing with 12, 15,000 square feet, and you have multiple thermostats, this is one menu that allows you to control every single thermostat in the house. And then lighting is a big part of it as well. In a home like this, you'll have a couple of hundred uh, light switches. This consolidates all those light switches into one menu and allows you to control any one of those lights anywhere in the home sitting here on the couch. I understand you can do a lot of this from your mobile devices and your watch right That's here. Right. Straight from the watch, you bring up the application and you have all of the same icons that you have on this on-screen TV interface right on your watch. Well, Jeremy, all this technology is great, but where do you hide it? I mean, I don't see any evidence of this anywhere. That's right. So we want to make sure that we have some sort of room allocated to all of this technology that runs all these TVs, the speakers in the ceiling, the cameras outside. Everything that you see room side has to have a source device that controls it. So what we do is we build up an equipment rack and we put all of this equipment within this rack that's properly thermally managed, properly wired, that allows us to maintain these systems for the long term. Okay, that's amazing. Now, you've received quite a few awards in the last few years. Five Mark of Excellence awards. One of them was in another Valley home, and that was a, a stealth project, yes. retrofit project. That's correct. So, retrofit project of the year, over $50,000. And what we did in that particular home was all about stealth. We wanted to hide the technology. We didn't want it to be obtrusive to the homeowner at all. We wanted it to be a situation where you could come in and be able to press a single button and that audio or video comes alive and people wouldn't even realize that the technology was built into the home. Okay, well congrats on that award. And what Thank else you. did you find at the Consumer Electronics Show? That's where you won the award, right? Yes, it is. So for 2017 and beyond, uh, the biggest ideas are virtual reality. Not only an idea, but this is really coming into the mainstream now. We're seeing folks being able to not only do gaming through virtual reality, but also to watch movies and to uh, take part in business applications as well. It's pretty awesome stuff. And how about with the appliances? Smart appliances is another big move into the industry. We're seeing refrigerators, ovens, and, and other appliances that can talk to the smart home system and make automatic adjustments based on you know, what your preferences are with relation to food in your refrigerator and what you want to cook that night. 
All right. Well, Jeremy, we can find out more about Futurian by going to your website. That's correct, FuturianSystems.com. We have these starter systems available for anybody that uh, wants to get their feet wet with this technology. All the way from $1,000 to $5,000 gets them started. All right. Well, thanks for your time today. Thank you so much.